Hey guys, day seven here of my 30 day vlog challenge and uh, today I'm going to talk about education. Um, I'm fortunate to have um, received a pretty uh, excellent education. Um, I was given uh, large scholarships to attend a um, private high school. Um, college preparatory education and then I uh, was accepted into a four-year university um, where I've also received a pretty good education and it's really it's kind of fucked up um, how I've been given access to this excellent education, um, but so many people, most people, will have not ever been given a chance to get even close to the education I've received. And there's those that that may, you know, say, well, you know, be grateful for what you have because, you know, now you can go out and, you know, have this great life. But It's like, how great of a life is it really for one person to pursue and to make money and get promotions and support a family? How great is it when... Billions can't can't even you know have a reliable source of income or a job or so many don't have access to free to to clean water or sanitation. And then when you look at it, it's like, what is, what is, what is the education system really doing, but, but dividing society and creating the haves and the have nots. Um, Really, I mean, your your place in life is is determined by your place in life is determined by your environment and the the access to resources which you're granted by virtue of you know the the, the place you're born in and. Um, so, so, you know, you, you can have a successful career, but, but that's just sort of a, a casino game. You're just lucky to be born where you are. And for the millions and billions who weren't born as you what what you know the it, their their lack of being able to create a, an enjoyable decent acceptable life for themselves is is no fault of their own um you know all babies 
are born not knowing how to read or or write or complete you know reports or 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 you know they don't have they don't have skills that they can put on a resume that's something that's that's uh, a direct function of of your place in in the hierarchy of life um so i think i think it's 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 up to i think it, those of us who who have been been given opportunities to um create skills such as being able to read and inform ourselves about what's going on in the world and to to write and and you know express um, our understanding of the world around us it's 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 up to us to to uh To make sure that those who haven't been given the same opportunities um, are one day one day granted access, equal access to something that should be a fundamental, you know, human right in 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 an education. Um, so. It's great to to go to school and get your degree and and you know get get a job and all but but when you know when it comes to success I think it's a time that we uh I think it's time that we take a look at redefining success within creating a world that is livable for everyone and um, that includes making sure that everyone has access to a decent education, not to mention, you know, food and water and, you know, our roof over their head. Um, thanks. Thanks.